Christ alone, my hope is found, and He is my light, my strength, my song, this cornerstone, this solid ground, firm through the fiercest drought and storm. What heights of love, what depths of peace, when fears are still, when striving cease, my comforter, my all in all, here in the love of Christ, I stand. Ooh. Good morning, dear friends. Here I am to share with God this word. And I'm reading from Psalm 125, verse 1. They that trust in the Lord shall be as Mount Zion, which cannot be removed, but abideth forever. Flying this close to Mount Everest in a 24-seater plane and seated on a single seat was an experience beyond words. But the thrill came riding over me when the pilot asked me to stand next to him in the cabin as the plane approached Mount Everest, the world's highest mountain peak, then was as though a hand breath on the right. It, I could see it on the right side and it was so close. I simply held my breath in awe of its awful, majestic strength, but more than that, stunned at God, our creator. I suddenly realized of course, it cannot be moved. It cannot be removed. In the plain cabin that awesome morning, I clearly understood what the psalmist was saying and what he meant. I, along with all those who trust in the Lord, cannot be removed. I cannot be removed. Cannot be even moved from him, but will assuredly be with him forever. Not only here on this earth where I walk, but forever, for eternity. So, trust in the Lord Jesus Christ, who is the Lord of salvation. Give your precious life to him, friends, confessing each and every sin, all your sins to him, seeking his forgiveness to abide forever, trusting in him, who is the Lord of life, Lord of life, Jesus, from everlasting to everlasting, for eternity. Amen. God be with you. And shalom. alone my hope is found and he is my light my strength my song this cornerstone this solid ground firm through the fiercest drought and storm what heights of 